How you guys doing today is Lamar. Welcome to my channel. Today I have a new video for you guys and ladies. Today I wanna help my viewers, subscribers, whomever stumbled upon this video today, find that bedtime scent. Um, when it comes to a bedtime fragrance, it is a thing, trust me, especially for people who have many fragrances and don't have the time to wear them all. Sometimes we wear them to bed. You know, a fragrance helps a lot with your cognitive function. So basically, say if you spray on a fragrance, you might feel a certain way. So when you go to bedtime, you want to feel relaxed. You want to feel great. You might want to have a happy night in the bedtime as well. So that will kind of correlate with which scent you will pick, you know, when it comes to a fragrance or it comes to the moment you spent in your bed, you know, so maybe you'll have a partner there or you just want to feel relaxed after a long day at work or you took a fresh shower and you want to feel calm and you want to have a nice sleep. It depends on the scent that you wear. You know, I know that bergamot helps with energy, so that helps to uplift your mood and then vanilla helps with calming your mood. So Notice that when you spray on vanilla, you like vanilla fragrances. Maybe you have anxiety, you want to be calm a little bit, so you spray a lot of vanilla, wear a lot of vanilla fragrances. So do, so do look at fragrances and the notes and how it affects your brain and how it affects your mood, and you could pick fragrances upon that as well. But today I'm going to show you four fragrances that are great for bedtime. So let's get it started. So the first scent that I'm going with today is going to be Grand Soir from MFK. Now, the reason why I pick Grand Soir is because it's such a sophisticated, classy scent. It's very alluring. It's very warm, very cozy and sexy. So if you're going to have a great night that night, if you know what I mean, um, definitely spray on Grand Soir. It has a cinnamon in there, has some vanilla in there. Like I said before, that vanilla just make you feel calm, sexy. It makes you feel relaxed, you know, so you want to be relaxed when you have that special moment in the bed. And especially that cinnamon, it makes you smell edible. You know, that edible feeling like someone wants to eat you up is a good thing as well. So this is a great scent to wear in the bedtime. If you're going to have that special moment, you know, and something great is going to happen, whatever is going to be, you know, you want to have a great scent and be prepared. So I think Grand Soir will have a great longevity. It'll make you feel relaxed or relax your mind. It smells sophisticated, smells sexy already. So it's going to do everything you need it to do to capture that moment or capture that great sleep at night. So my first bedtime scent is going to be Grand Soir from MFK. All right. Now, my second choice is going to be X-Man, not X-Men, not like Wolverine, X-Man from Clive Christian. Um, Clive Christian X is a great scent. There's a feminine one and there's a masculine one. Um, this one is the feminine one. I mean, sorry, the masculine one. The feminine one is great as well, but this is the masculine one. So this is X-Man. And this scent right here has the orris in there, has vanilla again, has the cinnamon in there. This is a great scent for that bedtime, for that special moment again. So if you don't like the sweetness of the uh, MFK Grand Soir, you can go with uh, X from Clive Christian. This one is going to be a little bit more drawn down, a little bit more sophisticated, a little bit more tart. Um, it's not going to be as sweet. You know, this one is a little bit more sophisticated and higher up when it comes to complexity. So if you're dealing with a complex person that you're going to sleep next to or be next to for that night, maybe a Clive Christian X will work. It'll be more um, sophisticated in a way of uh, a conversation. So when someone comes close to you to spend that night in that bed, uh, they'll be like, wow, you smell amazing. What fragrance is that? You know, and that kind of draw them away from that moment, kind of, you know, and bring them into you, you know. So this scent right here is amazing, has a great longevity, the projection is there. So I would say when it comes to spraying on a bedtime scent, do not spray a lot, one or two sprays, that's all you need because you're going to be close to that person. You're not going to be around, you're not going to be sweating, uh, possibly not, you know. So definitely spray two sprays. I think three is too much. You know, you can do two behind the ears or you could do two wherever you want to be kissed, you know? So that's all they always say that spray wherever you want to be kissed. So Clive Christian X is my second choice as a bedtime set. Now, you know, I'm going to feature my partners Marley for sure. Um, my second, well, second, no, my third choice is going to be Herod from Parfums of Marley. Now, I don't know what it is, but I'm keep on picking fragrances with cinnamon in there. Cinnamon, vanilla, uh, this one has tobacco leaf. This is a great scent for, 
if you want to be drawn down, you want to be calm. So say if you had a stressful day at work, you know, and you got upset by your boss or you're the boss and you're, you know, running around doing a bunch of things, uh, this set would be great because it will be very calm. You know, it's like you're smoking a cigar at the end of the night or you smell that great vanilla in there or that cinnamon. You know, this is a great scent to just draw you down. Like I'm at home now. I'm at peace. I have serenity now. You know, um, I'm in my four walls, I'm calm, no one's bothering me, no one's texting me. And you want to spread a fragrance that's going to bring you into that realm. And I think Herod does, it, does the trick perfectly. You know, it's not too strong, the tobacco, the tobacco is not too heavy. So it'll just give you the right key notes that you need for that warmness, that sophistication, that calmness that you need to wind down from a stressful day. So my third choice is going to be Herod from Parfums and Marley. Now, my fourth and last choice is going to be uh, Altair from Parfums of Marley. Now, this scent right here is the most potent vanilla scent. So this one right here is easily a unisex scent. So women and men can wear this fragrance. This is a great fragrance if you have a partner that you share the bed with and you want to spray in a fragrance together to make you feel calm and relaxed. This is great because you could spray on two sprays for you and two sprays for her or him, whoever. Um, and this will be amazing for you to keep you calm, keep you relaxed. You'll have a great bedtime uh, sleep for sure. You know, I know your bed and pillow and all those things play into it. But when I spray all thy air on for the nighttime and I'm about to go to bed, I feel amazing after. I feel great. I feel so relaxed. I feel like um i could just sleep all night long you know i do have a great night's sleep so definitely if you're not open to buying the bottle already you know get a sample spray it on in the bedtime and see how you feel in the morning time smell your shirt when you get up and see how that makes you feel you know after a great night's sleep and tell me what you think you can write it in a comment after your uh little experiment so all air is my fourth choice for that relaxing bedtime set now that's the video I have for you today. You know, um, when it comes to the bedtime, definitely pay attention to the fragrance you wear, you know, um, especially if you're going into bed with someone, you know, really pick a fragrance that's going to be great for that. And try wearing fragrance in the nighttime as well when you're going to bed, because sometimes I know some people don't want to smell like fragrance or whatever, but it does really help with your cognitive function and makes you feel calm, relaxed. So try it out, do a little experiment and tell me what you think. And give this video a thumbs up if I helped you. And subscribe for more. I peace.